hearts are excited to be here today. Tôi muốn nói với quý ông bà anh chị là cả đoàn chúng tôi đang rất là nôn nã để được đến thăm hội thánh ở tại đây sáng hôm nay. Isn't it great that Jesus is in all the world? Và chúng ta rất là sung sướng là vì chúng ta có Chúa Giêsu ở khắp nơi với chúng ta. Well, we would love to just stay with you all day long if we could. Chúng tôi đến đây rồi thì chúng tôi không muốn về, chúng tôi muốn ở đây chơi cả ngày với quý vị. And worship Jesus with you. Và chúng tôi muốn ở đây để tôi thờ phượng Chúa cùng với quý vị. Quý vị có cho không? Because we're all on the same level at Calvary. What an amazing morning we just experienced here in uh, an ethnic church uh, outside the city of Da Lot, Vietnam. This is the most amazing story here. We we walked into this little building where there were probably 250 to 300 people, ethnic people, in this building. And as they began to sing and worship the Lord, and we wanted so much to, to be able just to stay here for a couple of hours and worship God with them, but we're not allowed to do that. But right beside me stands a church that they've been working on since uh, 2012. And so what they do is they just, they spend what they have and, and, uh, and, and do as much as they can do with their budget. But then when their budget ends, then they stop and then they wait on the crops to come in because these are farmers and, and they depend on what kind of crop that they're going to have. It depends on uh, how good a crop and, and how things are going at that time, what they can do for the, uh, for the church building. So uh, they have to wait and see. So now they've been waiting since 2012 uh, you know, to finish this building here. And really, just to finish this building, they, they gave us a quote that, uh, where they could continue on with their building, which would be around $50,000. But we could do that like uh, at $10,000 at a time, just to keep them going and, and building this, this church. But the harvest is so great, it's just absolutely amazing to me if they could get this church built. The harvest would increase, I know, probably 80% than what it is now. And I'm thinking, my goodness, what an awesome God we serve. And, and as we begin to worship, I'm telling you, I'm a real emotional person. I really get emotional. But, but here, you know, I'm not allowed to get emotional like I would in America. But I'll tell you one thing. What we, we want to do is Mission Vietnam. We want to do our very, very best to expend everything that we can, all the energy and everything that God's blessed us with, to bless the country of Vietnam and the Christian people in this country. Because let me tell you, they're, they're being born again by the hundreds here. And just this local church that we just come out of, the number there was 750 members in this church. And so I, I, I would ever, I couldn't even think of the numbers that would increase when they get this church building built. And so, and they're amazing people. They love Jesus, they love to worship Him. They're dedicated, they're committed to Him, and, and it's just exciting for us to be here, for God to bless us as a team, Mission Vietnam team, to be here and to be a part of this great move, and we're so thankful for it. So I wish you could, would consider us in prayer, and if there's any way you can financially, I wish you would consider Mission Vietnam and what we're doing in this country. And we are financing church buildings all over this country. And we've been doing that now for, for a few years, but it's taken us now 18 years to get to this place where we can finally see the harvest and finally see uh, what we planted and sowed a long time ago. People have come along and watered it, and we don't care about that. But just to see God doing what he's doing in the country of Vietnam is, is just absolutely amazing. And we want to thank him so much so much for that blood he shed for not only us, but for the people of Vietnam. And I wish you could be here with me to experience this. I wish you could be with our team to experience what we feel and what we sense and what we see and what we hear in this country. It's just absolutely amazing. God bless you in everything that you can do uh, for Mission Vietnam. <laughs>